hope you're all well and in the best of health. This is Mawlana Khalil and we're on 87.7 FM Radio Ramadan. Inshallah, I'm here till 11 o'clock and I'm sure it's going to be one of those wonderful, brilliant, cracking evenings, Inshallah, and I'm also on Instagram. So if you've got Instagram, you can tap in and you can check and go into Mawlana Khalil. And you should find me there, inshallah, tabarakallah. So, ahlan wa sahlan, marhaban bikum. Welcome, people. Welcome, welcome on this Friday night. Uh, Maryam uh, says, salam, wa alaikum salam, wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Mashallah, people are joining, and mashallah, it's increasing. We're up to 50 people already. Ras Malai says, salam, wa alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Ras Malai, guess what? I'm actually going to have some Ras Malai after Tarawi. Mali has said, Salams MK, how are you doing? I'm doing great, Alhamdulillah. Absolutely fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Noreen says, Salams. Ibzi Khalifa says, Salams. Frames by Zarina says, Salams. Salamun alaykum bima sabartum fa ni'ma ukbadar. Salam to all of you. Salam to all of you. And the one and only Nalio says, Salams. And 50 Durush. Then, guys, can we have a bit of uh, your messages where you're listening from? And can I have some text messages? Salams from Uber Driver. MashaAllah. Salams Uber Driver. How are you, mate? How are you, buddy? Safe driving, man. Look after yourself and may Allah give you barakat in your driving, in your business, inshallah, tabarak wa ta'ala. And I hope there's other, many other taxi people out there today, inshallah. Any other taxi people, assalamu alaikum. Safe driving. Have a wonderful evening, inshallah. Ras Malai is part of the healthy diet you discussed. Salams <laughs> from Blackburn. The hijab wall from Blackburn. 500 durood sharif done. Wow. Mashallah, mashallah. Talking of Durood Sharif, we're expecting a super duper guest today, Khalid Patel from FCPM. He should be joining us very, very soon, inshallah. But I've got a few shout outs to do anyway. Shout outs again. I really, folks, yesterday was very romantic. Yesterday, love was in the air. Um, but today, let's see what happens today. Salams MK from Wix- uh, Salams, Salams MK from Wigston. Any other text messages? 077 So yesterday, I gave salams to one of our Tarabi brothers, uh, Molana Dean. And to his wife. So the other one got a bit upset today. And he says to me that, um, you know, how about me? You know, I've got a wife as well. I've got a, you should give a shout out for me. So from Maulana Sufyan or Hafiz Sufyan, um, he's, got, he's got a very bad headache today. So if his wife's listening to the radio, I would say get him some medicine, Taruk ibn Matu and maybe, you know, get some oil and give him a good rub because he's done Tarabi namaz, he's got a bit of a fever. May Allah Ta'ala give him shifa. And um, he says, you, you're a wonderful, wonderful wife. MashaAllah, Tabarak Ta'ala. So here we go. The wife shout-outs or the husband shout-outs have already started. Salams from Highfield Sharif. Well done, Highfield Sharif. How are you? We need to do a shoot out to the Moti Gang. Lots of disappointment with the draws. Yes, the Moti Gangs took away all the prizes yesterday, man. Kasme, bro. It took all the prizes, man. 200 Duru Sharif done. Guys, keep your Duru Sharifs coming in, inshallah. It's Friday night. It's the second Friday night of Ramadan Kareem already. Tomorrow is going to be a second Juma. Can you believe it, folks? It's going to be a second Juma tomorrow. So, wow, subhanallah, subhanallah, subhanallah. Shout out again. Yes. <laughs> shout out again. You don't have to give a shout. I'm just saying, man. Sanaz Morana, can you give a shout out to my mom and dad from San Zubair? San Zubair. Jubair Nataratri, shout out to mum and dad from Zubair son, mashallah. Assalamu alaikum, please give a shout out to Sister Taz. Sister T-A-S, salams, shout out to you from, I'm not sure who. Big salams to my husband, a.k.a., or oh, as known as, who I'm sure is listening to your show right now while driving. So known as Aka. Aka, salams to you, bro, from your wife, mashallah. You should be driving, safe driving. Don't take the wrong turn anyway, whatever you do. Jazakallah khair. So the shout outs, of, this is like the first time it's just, you know, giving you guys to shout out. And I think it's, it's a good thing, you know, you appreciate your, your spouse, your husband, your wife, your children. You're going to give salams to your kids as well. You're more than welcome. Salams to your mother, you know, your father, you know, your brother, your sister, your aunt, your kala, your four, your chachi, the whole ummah of Nabi Sassam. Feel free, man. You've got 10 minutes to do it. I just met uh, three lovely youngsters outside. Tariq Master, Arif Master. Yaqub Master, the Master Boys, mashallah. Lovely, lovely boys. As we all know about Arif Master, mashallah. He wrote that wonderful message to his dad. Um, so there you are, mashallah. So it's lovely to meet them. I think it's the first time this Ramadan I met Yaqub and um, Arif. I think I met Tariq once already. Yes, I did see Tariq once. Um, shout out to Moti, please. Abdul Rauf Kali gives his love to Abdul uh, Aziz Modi. That's very romantic. Brother Indo to Brother Indo. How sweet is that? Salams, shout out to my sister Fatima. Sehri isn't the same without SSG. 
Guys, any idea what does SSG mean? What does SSG mean? I'm going to ask this. S- shout out to my sister Fatima. Sehri isn't the same without SSG. Ahmad, shout out to you. Okay, there you are. Has, does anybody have any idea what is SSG? Guys, anybody in the studio? Nobody knows. And the person who texts, can you sort of explain what is SSG? Sugar? Nah. Sweet sugar ghee? Nah. No idea. Zero double seven four double eight double five zero double five SSG. Sweet sugar ghee? No. Samosa? Savouries? Nah. I give up <laughs> sausage. <laughs> I have no idea. Isn't the name without SSG? I'm trying to work this one out. Uh, I'm sure we'll get a reply in a few minutes. Zero double seven four double eight double five zero double five. Sweet sausage. <laughs> no, I have no idea. I'm waiting for them to reply. I'm waiting for them to reply. Guys, then tell me about your day, everybody. Tell me about your day today. How was your day today? How, good day, bad day, difficult day. How's the fasting going? What did you guys have for iftari and all that? Um, let me know. Let me tell me about yourselves today, guys. I want to hear about you guys today. As I wait for my respectable and honourable guest to come in, inshallah, uh, Khalid Bay. He should be here very, very soon. Be um, Ta'ala. You might have heard of FCPM. Um, he's in charge of it. He's the the one who made this FCPM app as well. So we are waiting for him. Zero double seven four double eight double five zero double five. So, so can we have a sh- the one who wrote this message? Shout out to Sister Fatima. Sehri isn't the same without. SSG, chicken wraps and rice, says Modium Reviews. Okay. So you had chicken wraps and rice. Nice. MashaAllah. Allah give you barakat. Anybody else? Did you guys have? Mas- Masi made some banging green chicken. Don't know what was in it, but we'd take it. Alhamdulillah. You should try mucho picante. Oh, gosh. Here we go. Right. Another message. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Molana, please give my kids Ayan and Iman a big shout out. They are 11 and 5. Both stay awake every day just to listen to you. Okay. Oh, that's so sweet. Ayan, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. And Iman, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Hope you're well and in the best of health. And a big shout out to both of you. Jazakallah for listening to my show. I really, really appreciate it. Um, thank you so much. And one day we need to meet up, inshallah. One day we need to meet up. Okay, folks. There you are. That's so sweet, mashallah. Little kids listening to the show when they should be in bed. It's not a bad thing. Now, now I'll give them a shout out. How are you, Kettle and Smoke? You all right? I think that's the title we should call you guys, Kettle and Smoke. All right. Salams all, says the food blagger. Right. We still haven't worked out what is SSG yet. Zero double seven four double eight double five zero double five. Come on, guys, you guys are a bit dry on Instagram today. Tell me what you've had today. You know, what did you eat? What did you drink? How's your day going? How's your Ramadan going? Is it going well? And come on, enlighten me, folks. Enlighten me. You know, I can talk, but I need you guys. I need your comments to keep on going. Oh, by the way, Zarina Ben, uh, I met Abdurov by. Uh, Zain, that's what we're trying to work out. Somebody's written a message here. Shout out to my sister Fatima. Sehri isn't the same without SSG. So I'm a bit stuck. Fish and chips today says, okay, same as yesterday. So Zarina Ben, I, as Abdul Rauf was leaving for after Tarawi, he goes, give a big shout out to my Zarina. Okay, Zarina Ben, so you're lucky, my your Abdul Rauf, your romantic husband, gives you lots of salams, mashallah. Sal's yummy delights, Lester says, egg, curry, and roti. Egg curry. Okay. Here's the ones. If we are listen, if we are watching or listening to the Quran on t- or Tarawi on TV or radio, and the Imam recites a verse with the sujood, does it become obligatory to, on us to process, process as well? No, you don't. You don't. Okay. Monana, what do you have for Sehri? Yesterday, I only had tea and biscuits. Yesterday, sometimes I have tea and toast. Sometimes it's the bread and cream and jam. Um, so. So somebody goes, pizzas from Amigos today. What did you have, Maulana? And tonight, this evening, I had Halim, right? Halim I had, right? And Halim is is a real proper South African thing. Halim, like in South Africa, you have to have Halim for iftari every single day. But I had my our neighbor sent some Halim and we had some um, meat as well. Assalamu alaikum, Maulana. I made kebab rolls and pastries for today and fries with the side with a side of mango and strawberry. Wow. 
It's good day. It's it's a good day as my mom has come to visit and stay in Manchester United, Nazifa. Why do you have to say that last bit, United? I mean, the message was really, really good until that last bit came in. Okay, curry kitchri and fish fry says Mems. Maulana had I had chicken pie. Mashallah, Allah Taala give you all barakat, inshallah. We're still trying to work out what is SSG, man. It's like S, some strange meaning of that. Cream jam is the one for Sari. I don't know if I don't know if many of you have cream and jam for Sari, but cream and jam is wicked. Cream and jam is you should try. It is so super duper. Sister Sehri Gang, is that true? Oh my goodness! <laughs> so SSG means Sehri Sister Sehri Gang. Wow. So if what is what if for brothers then? Brother BSG. Brother Sehri Gang. <laughs> okay. Uh, Sister Sehri Gang. Ya Rab. Zain said that. Okay. Say what is was Pandela. I want you Pandela. And all these technical terms and leftovers. Cream and honey. Cream and honey is also very nice as well. All right. What's actually Pandela? Can somebody explain what is Pandela? What, guys, where's Pandela? Kettle and smoked. What's Pandela? All right, let's do a Google search on that then. Pandela. Just make it what you're writing is in English, please, not in some French words that I have to try to pronounce. Salams to oh no, salams to all my SSG family. Molana, we had chicken samosas and squares with Philly cheese steak rolls and fries and school cake for dessert. Okay, brilliant. Mashallah, mashallah. Keep your keep your messages coming in. Inshallah. Salam to the SSG family, Marigya. Me and Zain went for uh, iftar early and ate Turkish food, says Ahmad. Oh, you actually had a date with Zain today. Ah, I thought you guys were like, like sort of, you know, distance these days. Pandela is also called Wara. Oh, Wara. is another name for Wanas. Pandela. Sounds cool, man. Pandela. Right, I've got my special guest coming in the studio now, guys. All of you behave now, right? With me, you can do all musty you want, but with this guest, there's no messing around. He's b- like a don of Leicester. I'm warning you guys. Right, Mashallah was a was a good iftari. Mashallah. Arif Abu Arif Abu Wat says, "How are you? I am good. Now we reunited today for a bit." SSG, that's so cute, Sister Sehri Gang. Salams Maulana says, Ahmad Ali, wa alaykum as wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. While our guest's microphone is being adjusted, as long as the guy doesn't break it, uh, we should be ready to go. Inshallah, Khalid Bay is in the studio, and we're going to kick off the show in just a few minutes. Inshallah, the barakatuh. Um, right. Huh? Okay, right. So this adjustment going on here in the studio. SSG. Khalid Bay, you know what SSG means? Sister Sehri Gang. BSG, brothers, no, no. Brother Sehri Gang. Ah, Salawat Gang. Salams from Dundee. Salams, Molana says, Tubes. Walaikum Salam, Tubes. Right. Have we got Kaliba's mic on? Yeah? All right. If, if, all right. Oh, so people, we have uh, Khalid Bay Patel. You might have heard of him. He's called um, the FC P- PM Don, right? The Durud Gang. Yes, the Durud Gang. Nadia, that's right. Anyway, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Khalid Bay. Wa alaikum salam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. How are you? Alhamdulillah. I'm okay, but it, I went round and round. Did you find a parking? There is absolutely no parking. Where did you pay the Rabi? I paid at Muddi. Uh, oh, so uh, just literally next so door. So then I dro- dropped the missus off home. Good idea. And then I came and I thought, let me find parking. But unfortunately, no parking. So the solution was only one thing. I had to pray the Rishiv. So Alhamdulillah, Allah opened the parking. Brilliant. Like well, no, no, no. Where do you pray Tarabi? I pray at Masjid Bukhari. I pray at Masjid Bukhari. So Muddi, what time does Muddi finish usually? Muddi is one hour, ten minutes. So Alhamdulillah, about 9.15 we finish. And then Somebody's uh, written, Asya says, also the dawn of moat. So now it's Mr. Patel, the best IT teacher at Moat says print and um, printing elegance. So all your students over here. Munib Sidyot gives salams to, to Kulsum. Happy birthday to her. Let's not do birthdays now, please. KP is a legend. Which one? There's two KPs here. Khalid Patel. This, this is a problem now. We've got a problem. We've your got initials a major are KP. Problem. 
Ah, uh, mine is okay. So could you please specify? But it must be you because you know what? Nobody's ever called me a legend before until you walked in the studio. So it's got to be you only. I'm kind so of disappointed with my audience. Khalil, you know? Khalil Patel. I'm Khalil Patel. And, and Khalid Patel. But, um, so the last letter is different. You know what? It's D. And you know what D stands for, don't you? Dangerous. No, Durud. <laughs> 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 All right. <laughs> MK is the original KP. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, Jazakallah. Like Ahmed, you got a doubt on one me. I'll, I'll, make sure one you, I'll, I'll make sure you win the ne- you you win the next voucher, inshallah, Taala. Anyway, so Kalibai, so how is Ramadan going for you? And Ramadan is well? Ramadan is jannat. You it's absolutely it? jannat. How's the fasting going? Fasting is going very fast. Joke, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Pardon the puns, folks. So Alhamdulillah, it just just flies by, especially when you're at work and you're teaching full mm-hmm. on. Alhamdulillah, it's uh, uh, no time. And when you get when you get home, asar, then iftari, and then tarawi, and mashallah, by the half past 11 o'clock, flat out. Flat out, yeah. And then back the next day again. So. How long have you been teaching at Mount for? I've lost count. 23 years. 23, 23 years. years. My goodness. So hence, all, all the Mount students out there, wherever you are, Start sending your salams through. Let's yeah, see who's I, out there. I actually went to Moat long, oh, long time ago as well. I'm a, I'm How a, many years was that? Foo, 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 1980. Yo, I'm going to make myself sound oh. really old now. <laughs> In the 1980s. But I went to the old Moat. You know the old Moat on Moat Road? When it was separate, yeah. Yeah, I went there. And then when the Maidstone Road one opened. Yeah. And then I went only for a few months. And I was, then I got to ship to Dewsbury. Mashallah, <laughs> mashallah, mashallah, mashallah. So yeah, I only went for a few months to the new building uh, on Maidstone Road, but prior to that, I went to the one on Moat Road. Surprisingly, a lot of our mashaykh and ulama, mm. or somewhere along the line, went to Moat. The likes of Maulana Salim Rasab Daman Barkatu, he also went to Moat long, long time ago before uh, the Bari, uh, and uh, even Sheikh Riyad Al Haq, I think, for a sh- short while, just went for mm-hmm. and then moved. Okay, I got one of your students. Says Bas. It says Basid. Salams, Mr. Patel. Basid Ali, your favorite student. Aha. Uh-huh. Mashallah, Basid. I'm thinking. I, I need to see your face. But Walikum Salam to you also. All right. Sure. MK the pioneer. So we got we got a different shape. We got to call KP and MK. <laughs> Something to get mixed up. That one there. But M- MK would be all right because KP to push a nut stage, I call Yeah, it. but they go completely nuts. <laughs> but the other thing is, if you look at a truck, it's still in the world's number one nut. It will be cheap, you. Okay, Kaliba, we're going to come to you in a minute, inshallah. I'm just going to finish a couple of no, things. No, no, off, finish it. Because I want to talk to you about your teaching career. I want to talk to you about your FCPM. I want to talk to you about your app. So I've got, I've got a million questions to ask you today. And then we're going to do a super dulu sharif at the end, inshallah. So now it's more like a confession. I skived your class one day. Apologies, time to repent. <laughs> uh, could you just give your name, please? As soon as you give your name, then uh, you're forgiven. Which ed- which MK is older? Did, okay, which MK is older? Oh. They'll have to guess now, isn't it? Inshallah. Okay, guessing okay. game. Okay, okay, we're gonna give you guys the time to guess. Assalamu alaikum, How are you? Uh, says Hajat Reviews. I'm good. So, guys, as you know, we're gonna we, we, just, we said we're gonna do Quran translation and one Hadith of the day, and then we're gonna talk about so the today is about. Uh, I'm gonna talk about Khalid Bay today. And we're going to talk about his FCPM. He's going to talk about his teaching career as well. Before I do that, I got one message of Khalid Bay. Salam, KP. You made me into a, sci- a computer science teacher, and a, since I've got white hair, before I reached thirty-five. Okay, I wonder who that Gosh, is. Um, a name no, would help. A name, no name there, no name there. Um, Salam, Molana, How are you? So, guys, um, we just if you're already beginners, no more messages for the next five, ten minutes, inshallah. And then when we start talking to Khalid Bay, then. Feel free to absolutely explode with your messages, inshallah. So, are we all ready for Alam Tara, inshallah? Alam Tara, kaifa fa'ala rabbuka bi ashabi al So, here we go, guys, inshallah, yeah? A'udhu billahi min ash-shaytani rajim Bismillahi rahman rahim Alam Tara, kaifa fa'ala rabbuka bi ashabi al So, Alam Tara, which means, have you not seen what Allah Ta'ala did with the people of the elephant? Alam Tara, kaifa fa'ala rabbuka Ashab will feel that Alam Tara, have you not seen Kaifa Fa'ala what Allah Ta'ala did with the people of the Ashab will feel with the people of the elephant? Alam Yaja'al Kaidahum fi Tadulil. Alam Yaja'al Kaidahum fi Tadulil. That we made their plotting and their plan a total failure. We made their plan and their scheme a total failure. What did Allah Ta'ala do afterwards? This is the Quran ayat first. وَأَرْسَلَ عَلَيْهِمْ طَيْرًا أَبَابِيلٍ 
wa arsala tayran ababil wa arsala alayhim tayran ababil arsala means allah sent what did allah tell us send tayran birds a flock of birds wa arsala alayhim tayran ababil allah telling you listen but this is what i did to these people wa arsala allah tell us sent tayran birds ababil a flock of birds what did these birds do tarmihim bi hijaratim min sijil they bombarded them and they pelted them with stones tarmihim which means means to pelt tarmihim bi hijara means butter stone tarmihim bi hijara min sijil these were baked like uh, um, cooked almost stones right and they came and they they were like bullets they were actually like bullets they hit them they would split them apart they would split um abraha and his army apart tarmihim bi hijara min sijil and what happened to these people faja'alahum ka asfim ma'kul faja'alahum ka asfim ma'kul faja'alahum ka asfim ma'kul and they became like chewed straw they became like chewed straw right clay right so what happened is that you know when, you, when a cow eats food and then it spits out in the end right that's how they became faja'alahum ka asfim ma'kul they became like and chewed straw so allah now is describing the people of abraha the army of abraha who came to um, knock down the kaaba and obviously we're not going into details of the story of abraha and the army but this year, and this is this year is called the year of the elephant and that is the year in which rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam was born around 40 days after this incident nabi sallallahu alaihi wasallam was born okay folks so this is the the quran for today and tomorrow inshallah we're going to start the ila fi quraish tomorrow so we try to finish each surah or oh, i might do a short surah tomorrow because tomorrow is friday and then from monday do two two days one one surah that, that might be better inshallah i hope this i hope the translation has helped folks um i hope the it helps you in your recitation and i also make dua to allah taala that when you're praying namaz next time alam tara kayfa fa'ala rabbuk bi ashabi alfil then you can visualize you can think about the meaning and the translation and i pray to allah it will help you in your namaz inshallah today's hadith is a very very every hadith of rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam is very very important every hadith is very very important right but today's uh, hadith is a, a if we if we follow this teachings of rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam then i tell you folks we are guaranteed success in dunya and akhirat it's very short it's very sweet but it's um, can we hold on to it? is is the key thing over here so this is the hadith of rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam which mentions right if i'm going to mention two short hadiths today man kana yu'minu billahi wal yawmi al akhir falyaqul khayran aw liyasmut aw kama qala alayhi salatu wassalam nabi sallallahu alaihi wasallam says whoever believes in the last day man kana yu'minu billahi wal yawmi al akhir whoever believes in the last day then what should they do two things falyaqul khayran then they should either say something good or remain silent kalas so sweet if you got something good to say say it otherwise just remain silent right this is this tongue of ours brothers and sisters it's 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 very good and it is also a killer as well it all depends how you use this tongue right jirmuhu sagir wa jirmuhu kabir this tongue this piece of flesh is very very small but the amount of damage it can do is huge but at the same time this tongue of ours if we use it nicely it can do wonders as well it can bring people closer it can it can unite people it can bring love between people and when you don't use it properly brothers and friends then it can it can distance people it can create friction it can break families it can do a lot a lot of damage so my brothers and sisters man kana yu'minu billahi wal yawmi al akhir nabi sallallahu alaihi wasallam says who believes in allah and in the last day fal yaqul khayran say something good or either remain silent okay so that's one teaching now i'm going to teach you one dua i'm sure you all know this dua but please make this dua this next one a dua after every single namaz it takes you 5 seconds it takes you 5 seconds right um, it's 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 small but it's so jami and it's so amazing and it's so fantastic so fantastic and the hadith is nabi sallam says allahumma inni as'aluka al-'afwa wal-'afiyah that's it oh he asks allahumma means oh allah inni i am as'aluka i'm asking you for forgiveness and for afiyat after every namaz make this dua is very very powerful folks i hope you got this folks allahumma inni as'aluka al-'afwa wal-'afiyah and you can also add on fid dunya wal-akhirah ya allah 
forgive forgive me i'm asking you to forgive me and grant me afiat in dunya and akhirah folks do you have you all got this i need some response from you guys either text message or instagram inshallah allahumma inni as'aluka al-'afwa wal afiyah ya allah i'm asking you for forgiveness ya allah and i'm asking you for afiyat afiyat means protection in everything uh afiyat means protection in absolutely everything in your in your life in your in your wealth in your household with your family with your children with your wife with your husband with your brothers with your sisters with ev- in your job everything you're asking allah to give you total protection it's a beautiful unique fantastic amazing awesome dua of rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam so i request all of you allahumma inni as'aluka al-'afwa wal-'afiyah fi dunya wal akhirah o allahumma inni as'aluka al-'afiyah o allahumma inni as'aluka al-'afwa wal-'afiyah read this dua after every noise but before you get up from your namaz place allahumma inni as'aluka al-'afwa wal-'afiyah right fi dunya wal akhirah right simple as that folks right i'm going to ask you now how many of you guys are going to read this dua inshallah allahumma inni as'aluk al-'afwa wal-'afiyah fi dunya wal akhirah anybody out there inshallah let's have some feedback inshallah 0774885055 jazakallah for this dua molana barakallah barakallah this is my job here on the radio station yes we have a laugh we have a joke but at the same time inshallah it's important that we we get the message across um zuli says yes i need at least 20 people to say yes man come on I need some response. Sumi says yes. Masha, that's two people. Allahumma inni asaluk al-afwa wal-afi fi dunya wa al-akhira. NK Nas says yes. That's three. Come on, people. I, I need 17 more people to say. All you have to do is type, folks. Right? If this was a giveaway, now you'd be saying yeah, yeah. Tick, 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 tick. Four done. Five done. Masha Allah. Five people then said yes. Six done. Masha Allah. Simos says yes. Seven. Nadia says eight. Masha Allah. That's more like it. Come on then. Hafsa. Uh, says yes safian that's 10 hanifa 11 mashallah come on let's have a few more ahmad 12 12 people so far just name 13 mashallah allah ta'ala accept not a single text message coming yet 13 people said yes yes inshallah says bint yusuf that's 14 yes says lubs 15 five more to go Yes inshallah may Allah reward you for teaching us that 16 that's a text message mashallah finally gigs 17 17 people done three more to go come on all of you and you're all listening at home man you can't be that tight to say mm. tubs 18 115 people listening yeah i'm sure they can type in a khalid bay 18 thumbs people, up yeah. send them a thumbs up it it's the last says yes 19 and who's it? Yeah, Fahima Kamani says 20. Brilliant. I'm sure you've got 25 people you can do it. Sham says yes, 21. Four more people. people. Zalina Ben says yep, 22. And somebody's put a thumbs up, 23. Two more people. Two last people who said yeah, we're going to read this. Nafisa Ben says yes. Sometimes my best friend isn't well. Please make dua she feels better. Inshallah, may Allah mm-hmm. give you a best friend. Shifai Kamila Ajila Mustamirra. Inshallah, I currently play short one, Naz. Short one, long one, whichever you want to do, Inshallah, go for it. Mashallah, more people are coming in. Yes, uh, I am for... <sighs> Can we have a written version? Okay, I'll put it on my Insta page. I'll put it on my Insta story, Inshallah, after the show, Inshallah, all right? Okay, brilliant. Jazakumullah khair. Allahumma inni as'aluka al-afwa wa al-afiyah fi dunya wa al-akhirah. Allah Ta'ala bless you all. And I make dua to Allah. Allah Ta'ala grant you all afiyah, Inshallah. Now... Folks, um, you can still keep your messages coming in now because now I'm talking to Khalid Patel. Um, right, let's have a little competition here, Khalid. Bhai. Let's just, because you're KP, I'm KP, mm-hmm. right? So we need to find out who's the original one. Right? <laughs> right. So we've got to take a guess, right? Who's older, right? I guess we're both in our 50s, correct? So we'll give him a clue. Well, we'll do warm and cold, you know? Yeah, we'll do warm and cold. Okay, let's go for Khalid Bay first. Yeah? Yeah. All right. Okay. People, you want to take a guess on Khalid Bey's age? His wife's not allowed to enter. <laughs> Somebody goes, blue packet. Okay. Anybody want to take a guess? Nobody's, nobody's typing different thing. What sort of game are you guys playing? 55, somebody's asking. 55. Uh, cold. Cold. No, sorry, warm, warm, warm. Warm, 56. Very warm. 56. Uh-huh. Getting colder. 54. Getting warmer, very warm. Um, 
Kom, vi ice. 59. <laughs> ice cold. Okay. So 53. Spot on. Spot on, yeah? So, mashallah. Right. So you're, 53. You're, you're 53. All right, people. Khalid Bay is 53. Mashallah. You want to tell which month your birthday is in? You might get a birthday present. You never know. It's not going to that. <laughs> oh, no, it's not going to that. All right. Then. Okay, Khalid Bay is 53. Guys, all right. Your, your chance to get myself now. Okay. Somebody goes, we need proof. I mean, like, Somebody goes, 59 and a half. Right. That's not funny at all. Very, very cold. 53, hot. 56, coolish. 19, really close to Nalio. That's I like that 19 one. 54, bingo. That's the one, yes. I'm 54. Amina Patel, well done. So I'm the original nut. So <laughs> one year older than me, Al- mashallah. Yeah. Yeah, 54, so yeah. Um, yeah. So you're born in 1970, yeah? Exactly. Okay, I'm 1969. 69, okay. Yeah. There you are. Charo by Khalid Bay. I'm more doha than you are. Anyway, The second question could be, where were you born? Leicester. Oh, I'm, not a, I'm not a Leicester lad. You're from North, I guess. Yeah, right? I'm from Batley, North. Dewsbury. Um, you can guess? Blackburn? Yes, spot on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you got okay, it you look away. like you're in your 30s, mashallah. Jazakallah khair. I'll take that compliment. The diet really does its job really well, by the way. <laughs> like, okay, so Khaliba, you were born in Black, so which year did you come to Leicester? Uh, 1984, when I was 14 ah, years old. 14 years old. Mm. The whole family moved, mum, dad, everyone? Well, my dad had passed away when I was two years old, but Allah then my, my brother moved here, my sister moved here, so uh-huh. we all decided to move here. Uh-huh. Because Blackburn was quite a challenging place at that time. Really, uh, uh, racism. Really, full on, full on. Yeah. Send you home early from school because obviously yeah. you're under threat of getting uh, beaten up. Paki bashing. Yeah, paki bashing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You remember the term? <laughs> <laughs> That's what it was at the time. And then you guys moved to Leicester. How did you find Leicester in the eighties? It was a shock because uh, I'm used to being in Blackburn. In those days, there was a very white community. Mm-hmm. Then you come to Leicester, and I think, what's this? All very multicultural and yeah. very colourful. I was uh-huh. quite uh, intrigued by the whole situation, so it was quite different. Interesting, interesting. And um, you settled in very easily, I guess, very no issues at all. Um, because you must have found it so good compared to where you are from Blackburn, so you must have settled in quite Yeah, and I, I had the, my, the company of Mr. Lambert. It's Mohammed Lambert, if you're listening. Ah, Mohammed Lambert. Mohammed Lambert. So Mohammed Lambert, Maxinit. That's it is, though. So he, they also moved from Blackburn? They're originally from Blackburn, but they, then they moved um, later on, much earlier. But so I you know Mohammed from Blackburn? I know Mohammed. Mohammed's mom is my cousin's sister, so ah. obviously we're related, cha, cha, and we're best friends uh, at that time. You know. Mashallah, Mashallah. I mean, what happened to him? <laughs> Good question. <laughs> But well, actually, he's after Kaju. You know who Kaju is? The cat. The cat. Kaju the cat. Yeah, there's a debate in the house who he loves more, the wife or the cat. But anyway, that's another an debate for another day. But Mohammed, you can answer that. Musa, are you listening? Uh, Musa, are you listening? This is uh, his son, Musa Lamba. Yeah. Okay, so Mohammed Lamba from Blackburn. So you came and then. Um, I mean, you've been teaching. I know you were in Darum Leicester at one time as well. I remember that I used to teach IT and everything. Uh, if I if I recall correctly, that's right. right. That's right. Right. Uh, It's actually a quite a um, a funny story how I got into all this teaching, because actually I, I, I I'm listening. Says Musa Lambat. <laughs> oh, that's good. But, but, it's but a it's a I bet you he's having tea and cake. Every time he's got a cat next to him, yeah. right? He's got chai and he's got cake, and he goes, "I never eat." <laughs> Anyway, Musa, what's he doing? What's your dad doing, by the way? So I want to ask you a question, right? Um, so we've got, we're going to do this in 10 minutes, inshallah. So I, in, in few minutes, summarize your teaching career. I mean, when you started teaching 25 years ago, almost, and how, how was teaching then and how is teaching now? I just, it, I, I'm a teacher in Madrasa as well, right? I, I'll tell you my experience, but how do you find change in teaching students how it's how it's changed no change no the change. funny thing is no change what, what do you mean no a, change? Stu- a student is still a student and uh, if they make effort then they'll do well the the behavior issues are still there um the have they gone worse have they gone bad is it um, the same the, the 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 behavior has become more digitized so obviously the behavior now is controlled by the mobile devices Whereas before, you know, they're going around and having a, a bit of a laugh and getting into trouble uh, and these kind of things. Now it's more 
based from social media and from whatever they've got in front you of you find it more challenging now than before personally i find it all the same because i've been in the game for so long but um the the students are much more uh, how just smarter in misbehavior if you understand what i'm saying okay they're much more smart they do must be do in a way that yeah, they get very cleverly done mm. so obviously many times the students out there if you're listening many times we think that the teacher has been fooled mm. but in fact the teacher knows everything but there's a lot of tolerance you have to go yeah. by but one thing i've learned throughout all the years husnezan good hopes with everybody because i've seen students who have become doctors and pilots and and really well i become ulama also and alimas and at the same time i've seen students who have unfortunately ended up in prison mm-hmm. and i've seen students who also have passed away so i've seen the full you've spectrum you've seen it all you've seen, you've it, seen all. it all and uh, yeah so it's been a very long journey i remember when i left darulum you know lester darulum mm. and uh, i made mas- mashwara with my sheikh my isu mutar rahmatullah ali so he goes here a few th- you know 100 will benefit in darulum here thousands will benefit So listeners out there if you are more students did you benefit from the, um, uh, being at the school uh, we are at I'm not going to mention but you know that anyway um, note, and note. obviously how much of an impact do we teachers really have that's the question yeah, and did you like being in Khalid Patel's class sir, yeah. Ka- sir Khalid's class be honest yeah if it's, if it's, if it's a yes say yeah we loved him if we didn't like him just say we didn't like him simple as that but just say the truth but I'm sure you loved him anyway um do you find change in attitude of the youngsters the way they are today compared uh, because the way i see it right i think i thought teaching many years ago was a lot more simple in madrasa there was a lot more respect for the teachers this is the way i see uh, my teaching mm-hmm. uh, career in madrasa over the years i'm listening to teach it became more difficult students attitude behavior not just students, but parents as well before parents were very supportive of the teachers right and this right now the parents are almost worse than the <laughs> i'm not saying every parent right i'm saying a lot of parents are they, they become quite difficult to deal with and that makes it that makes it because you know the teaching is not just about making them teach uh, it or giving them maths or english it's teaching them making them good people ne? that's right that, that's it's the, the whole, most the whole thing, package right the whole thing you're making them an insan it's, you, you they can become a great lecturer they can become a great teacher but if they got no insaniyat inside them and they got no akhlaq inside them then it defeats the purpose you, you school is great the knowledge is wonderful but I, i think that over the years i think i i i've seen that change i think the the way I, i'm not i'm not having a go at the kids i'm not saying the kids are bad i think the way the world's changed and the way things have before life was very simple now the, you know these, these mobile phones these gadgets these tablets this i don't think that's actually helped our youngsters i actually feel sorry for them i don't envy the kids I actually feel sorry for today. That's this why my, my comment is social media mm-hmm. has made everybody unsocial mm-hmm. because they find it very hard to yeah. communicate behind the screen and could be keyboard warriors and typing away and sending messages away yeah. whatever but if face to face they're finding very difficult mm. and the concentration span is in there also. Oh, yes, yeah, it's, it's because terrible. obviously the screen you're moving around fast mm. so it's the same way in life they want quick 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 No. and uh, without effort we have to get something so this this is change they won't ach- they won't achieve greatness without much effort that's right huh? that's that's the problem it is it's true problem. like before you had to work very you had to go to the library you had to study you had to do this you do that before and used to work very, i'm not saying the kids don't work hard it's it's different they work hard in a different way today we used to work hard i'm not well i didn't really work, work much hard anyway I, i went to motor as well but <laughs> back in those days we won't There was never I mean that's another story for another day anyway we'll, we'll move on from there. So okay it's so a teaching okay moving away from teaching now Kaliba. So this whole FCPM thing. Mm-hmm. How give me the history of that what and what does it mean and so let me just tell you folks this Kaliba is he started a thing called FCPM right and it's it's I think it's going to be a very interesting story because I don't even know when he started it how he started it what made him start it so the mic's yours what made you go into this? I can spend hours on this but uh, I'm going to hopefully make it short. No. Actually initially Durusharif and Salawat has been a very appealing thing to me and I remember many years ago Hazrat Monana Adam rahmatullah who just passed away mm-hmm. you know used to go in this company and he would be reciting Durusharif and you said wow this is is that like this magnetic buzz right anyway so what happened was that uh, 
you, you know, people recite, recite and you saw that. So, so we just carried out. One day we decided to go, alhamdulillah. Uh, I got lucky like, <coughs> to, to go to Medina Munawara. We went mm-hmm. Hajj. Mm-hmm. And actually, I was with uh, Ahmed Kasu also. I remember okay. on that journey. Legend. Yeah, the legend himself. So we went to Medina, and on the way to Medina, mashallah, we spent time and everything else. And, you know, you got this desire and that love, and it just increases more and more. Anyway, to cut it short, one day what happened was that. Um, um, uh, you know, the radio Hajj was happening many years ago. If you Mona remember, Manajib, Manajib, Manajib. Okay, yeah. okay. So radio Hajj was happening, and I used to listen to it also. And I go, Mashallah. And then what happened was that you know, um, uh, it just so happened that uh, Ahmed Bay actually came to my house and asked me that, would you like to do a show uh, uh, about Nabi Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam? And why was that? Because obviously he was with me in, in the Hajj time, and we were going to Medina. And you know, while you're going to Medina from Makkah, and we're in a state, <coughs> and the love of Nabi Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Anyway, so he must have heard that. So he came anyway, and he said, can you do a show tomorrow? Like, first time ever in my life, and we done a show before. Mm-hmm. I thought, yeah, what? Wife say, oh, can you do that? You know, you'll be able to do that. Anyway, I said, yes, because uh, the previous night, um, it, was, um, it was a dream, and in that dream, Nabi Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, do a show. So anyway, next day I did a show, and what do we call the show? So Allah just put it in the heart that I looked around and everybody's crazy with teams, with football, with you know, with our idols and our pop stars and whatever. People's got a, a fun club. Yeah. Then I thought to myself, hang on, we need to have a fun club also, but for who? The Prince of Mankind, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Hence, FCPM yeah. came around. So FCPM actually initially stood for Fun Club of the Prince of Mankind. Yeah. Later on, through the Sheikh's Mashwara, he called it uh, Fun Club of the Prophet of Mankind, which is the okay. same letters. Okay. That's where FCPM started. Right. And then Which year was that? <sighs> that is, uh, I think, probably 2007 or something. Yeah. You're, looking, you're hitting nearly 20 years then. Yeah. 17 years yeah. take you yeah. roughly, yeah? So anyway, we started the show. It was a huge, very popular, and it continued. And then Ramadan radio indeed happened, and and then more and more and more. And then eventually, um, the 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 biggest change was uh, I went to Alum Bari okay. to see my Sheikh in Ramadan. And what happened was that my Mother, I told him that would you, that would you do a show and would you do a live link up. So he said, I'll let you know later. And then later on, he said, yes. Mm-hmm. And that was it. That yeah. was a big hoo-ha everywhere. Massive. And, and we had a big live link up. And then since then, it he, just... He did it for a few days. Uh, 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 between Asr and Maghrib. Yeah, and initially. Yeah? Initially. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. Three days continuous, actually, between yes, them. And then that. after that, he told me, then fine, I'll do it for the next... Every year, whole of Ramadan, every day. And for six years then... Uh, mashallah, we had live link ups, and through yeah. that, so much care came out, and whatever else. Anyway, to cut it short, after that, um, one of the programs we did was of Duru Sharif, and then we did a compilation from there. And then, next thing you know, we published that as a kitab, yeah. as a book. And then that was published in thousands. And then, from there, an app was made. And from there, a website was made. And from there, social media came on. And then it just carried on and on and on. And then we had events constantly everywhere. Shows were happening everywhere. And then on top of that, then um, I got permission then through Hazrat that Mondays, Durud Majlis every week. So And that's been running for the past 15 years. Rotates in people's houses. And we have this Durud Majlis. And one of the biggest initiatives this year we want is that I need 100 houses in this yeah, who are ready to host a Durushi Madis at their house for 30 minutes only. Once a year, they'll get an opportunity. 30 houses? 100 houses. 100 houses. houses for 30 minutes only, once a year. Right, we've got 48 houses already. So we need to make it to 100 houses. So Monday and Wednesday, half an hour, Durud Madlis only at their house, at their establishment, at their place. Alhamdulillah. So that is the biggest drive we're going to have this year. So it's just escalated, and that's what's happened. And through that, what's kept me going, I'll be honest, is that literally daily, people sending salawat amounts, and we're talking millions. People sending constantly millions, constantly, every day. I have some people who send, you know, 10,000, 20,000 a day, continues without fail for years on end. Fantastic. And some are reaching 100,000 a day. 
Uh-oh. And they send 100,000 and the messages come through every day. And that's the driving force. And on the other side, mashallah, dream after dreams, dreams after dreams, mm. people are relating. And it's just the buzz. And yeah. that's that connection with Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. So that's a sal- salawat and durud drive. So my mindset in the morning, I wake up straight away, I'm thinking durud. And my messages that go out on thinking, social media. Eating, drinking, durud. It's that's like your right. life becomes durud. <laughs> that's that's right. Uh, the, you know, I... I this app of yours, when did you uh, introduce it? So app? the app was actually about 10 years ago. We made it in the initial, initial form. And then it was popular then, alhamdulillah, about 8,500 users a day. That's how many. And, you know, you're talking about 10,000 downloads a year. So for 10 years or so, about 10 years ago, sorry. Only recently we've redone it all. And now the redone version is really, really popular. And I'm sure you, mashallah, you've also... Yeah, you know. I, I mean, I, I'm in love with the app. I'm going to be... So could you, could you just tell what the app is? Uh, how do you download it? What do you, if you, do you go to Apple or uh, Android stores and you just type in FCPM, okay. FCPM, it will come up, download that. It's free download. And on there, you can listen to Salawat. You can recite all these different compilations. You can... It's a tasbih on there also. It's You can all the virtues on there. It's an A to Z package of Salawat. How have you benefited, Mona? You know, I, I went for Umrah in December, right? So I took it with me. Uh, I downloaded it. And I absolutely loved it. I said that to you when I came mm, back. That's right. And I said, I absolutely love this app. Um, it's brilliant. It's fantastic. It's got it's beautiful, folks. And I would highly, highly recommend, guys. There's 97 people watching me on Instagram, 98 now. And people listening on the radio at home, wherever you are, download this app. It's called FCPM. It's got amazing Dulu Sharif. It'll change your life, honestly, and then you can read the Durood Sharif every single day, which I want you want the 40 Durood, etc., etc. It's a must-must. In my opinion, it's a must-must. Do it, you'll 100% benefit. I mean, I, I downloaded it in December. I saw it many times before, but I didn't download it, but I did download it in December, and since then, I've not looked back. It has been the most, mashallah, wonderful, wonderful thing. So I, I would say to people... Um, you know, this is uh, somebody goes. I absolutely love it. Somebody goes. Um, so jazakallah khair for that. Um, but yeah, but, um, people who have got the app, please your your thoughts as well. Inshallah, we haven't got much time left, so I'm going to give Khalid Bay two more minutes. Inshallah, the Bahadur Kutala. So you know what, the app is is brilliant. The website is great. The Rushdu is coming in. Mashallah. Ibrahim Lumbat says Subhanallah. Subhanallah. <laughs> right, but uh, yeah, I would brothers and sisters, if you don't have it. Tonight, the first thing you guys do is just make sure that you download the app. It is absolutely super duper. Very good app, mashallah. Somebody says, Jazakallah khair, Badakallah fiq, mashallah. And it increases your love with Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. No doubt about it. A few Khalid. minutes, I just want to ask uh, out there, who's ready to host the Nurud Madlis at their place? Okay. If they can't mention it now, how can they con- uh, contact you? Um, if they can, the fcpm at hotmail.com. Uh, or the UK or the number FCPM. you can on the FCPM number. If you go to the FCPM app, you yeah. can get the number. It's public anyway. So you want around fifty-two homes because you got forty-eight done yeah. um, to host a Dudu at their house either a Monday or a Wednesday yeah, that's for right. thirty minutes in a year. Thirty minutes people, once in a year they'll get well, opportunity. Yeah. So people, anybody in Leicester, we talk about Leicester here, yeah. right? Yeah. So we talk about the people in Leicester. If there's anybody who would love uh, like Khalid Bay to come down. Right and host the Durood Sharif with this on a Monday or a Wednesday at your house for 30 minutes only. You know, let, let Khalid Bay know at fcpm at hotmail.co.uk. Or go on, the app, or go on the FCPM app and you can send And the numbers are on there also. On, on the Khalid Bay's numbers. What capacity does the house need to hold? It, the, the gathering is normally about 10 on average people come okay. and it's streamed online. And it's for 30 minutes only. So 10 people can fit into one room, no problem. Some brothers come and, and, it's, and it's, it's streamed online. Um, the, the sisters can listen in from the other room and the brothers of that family. And what's happened is that families actually get together mm-hmm. and they all come. Alhamdulillah. I said, what I do? I'll come with you. You do the duty of others. I'll go in there. I'll have the snacks. <laughs> Mashallah, right. why not? Right. Uh, somebody goes downloaded. Somebody goes on the iPhone. Is it the second one on the iPhone? Somebody's asking. It's FCPM and it's green. It's FCPM and it's green. Okay, it's FCPM and it's green. Inshallah. <laughs> so to keep that in mind, folks. Download it, guys. Download it. I want every one of you. Muhammad Lama, I'm, Muhammad Lama says I'm always ready. And he is ready actually. He's one of the forty-eight thousand. Ek karawe ke ni gere. Wo karawe. Don't want to come. Don't want to come. Ek karawe. 
I wonder what kind of kind of get only kind of but it never does it man cuz me bro mom I'm coming to Khalid Bay man I see that my dubo junior dose teacher so child I'm going to come down it's is it is it gosha no it's not gosha either no man green let me just find it on my phone let me just see if I can show it to you guys hold on you got an apple this one I know okay so it's this one guys it's yes okay So as as you can see this over here it says fcpm as you can see on my phone fcpm download it inshallah download it inshallah tabaraka taala it'll be it'll come very it's the one high. above gosha if you did apple search it's the one above this is the one is it's suppo- it's above gosha right this is the one folks you got it people or turn the phone around so you can see the right way around anyway <laughs> this way folks right what is khalid's boy's favorite durood ibrahim nambat My favorite durood is the simplest one out of them all. Sallallahu alaihi wasallam. And shall I tell you a fact? You say sallallahu alaihi wasallam for 15 minutes continuously, mm-hmm. you can do a thousand. 1000 durood just by doing 15 minutes continuous sallallahu alaihi wasallam. So what a buzz. We can all do it mashallah and the jibes there. Okay, guys, so I want all of you by tonight to download FCPM. If anybody is interested in also hosting Khalid at his house Um, fcpm at hotmail.co.uk go into the fcpm app there his telephone numbers there you can then contact him inshallah if you go there brother ibran has just said marshal he's ready to host it he's just sent an email this now there you are all 50 51 to go okay guys we've got three mi- wait can we extension two minutes jazakallah khair right guys uh, i'm just going to move away from khalid by one second before we come back to the durood sharif do get people don't forget the giveaways the tomorrow's giveaways is uh, by sns gym SNS Gym is given a free one month membership right so that's in tomorrow night's prizes inshallah and also CMOS CMOS uh, is giving away a bottle of CMOS is really meant is meant to be really good for you so these are the prizes tomorrow and three candied bacon ice creams <laughs> don't ask Kalipe <laughs> three candied bacon ice creams very very delicious right um somebody's asking any ch- i think that's probably thing of the age now any chance of getting the fcpm durood cd or oh, the original ones we yeah. might find some somewhere we stopped making them because of uh, everything's on yeah, the cloud changed. now yeah, yeah, exactly. um you can listen to the tracks on the fcpm app but uh, i'm sure you can send me an email or contact yeah. me and then i will find anything one. you want we're going to do it just send khalid bay inshallah and i'm sure khalid bay will be able to assist you and help you what a combo we got ice cream and gym membership <laughs> yes nali i didn't think of that So yeah we got Durood Sharif sorry we got we got um, gym membership one month in SNS gym I know marhum Salim Salang when he used to be alive he, he gave me a lifetime membership because Mulsab Tamaharu lifetime membership you know what the problem is I never used it I find the gym the most boring place on the planet can I but you ever go gym no I went once and I got too much aches and pains and I left it <laughs> I'll, I'll tell you a story on that so I I went to the gym once and I took a friend with me uh, he's probably listening to this program maybe And we got to the gym and it's like a you know when a kid goes to into a toy shop you see all these yeah. machines and this they hit up boy he got really really excited so he went on the treadmill the muscle down it about everything right and I rang him and I said to him take it easy this is the first time you know so but he wouldn't listen to me the next day I rang him I said bro you ready he was money said I'm having a heart attack he do, you know you know he's doing all those weights and everything this all his chest must have been hurting <laughs> my man thought he was having a heart oh, attack I've never I mean I like like Uh, like table tennis or badminton or tennis mm. or something like that or football or cricket like team sports yeah. but if you ask me to go to the gym ah, it's it's not my favorite place i'd rather do the boxing you know if uh, up to have this man sali cki mm-hmm. right i i love that uh, that that's my sort of thing you know i mean i like that punch bag you can take all that yeah take the anger out yeah but do good but do gonna go so you take it out over there you know what i'm trying to say right but um But yeah, uh, CK, how is this man son? You know, I taught him martial arts, you know. They don't His brother is my... Yusuf Bey. Uh, Yusuf Bey is my yeah. son's father-in-law. Shall I better say way. much? I'm going to keep it quiet. <laughs> All, right, yeah. All right, people, right. We've got Take two it. minutes. We're going to do a bit of Durud Sharif now. So, you know, as I every day, every Friday, we read Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, like in the tune. Sallallahu ala Muhammad. So, guys, are you all ready, inshallah? We might extend it by another minute. Kettle. Asama, the reason I call him kettle, I asked there's a voucher called kettle and smoke. It's a yeah, shop. Yeah. He called it kettle and smoke. So, so now I'm putting you bitch on a kettle and smoke. <laughs> anyway, bitch. 
Assalamu alaikum says Fia Yon Ni Islam. I think that's from Albanian. Cousin. Guys, are you all ready? We got a Don FCPM Don here, Khalid Bay, inshallah. And we got the original, which is me, because I'm older than him, just by a year, alhamdulillah. <laughs> so, 53 and 54. But the same initials, Khalid Patel, Khalil Patel. May Allah give you all good things in life and you did. And that you did, that you give people in need. May Allah protect you in this month of Ramadan. Respect mm. from Damir Kilmandi of Kosovo. We love you very, very much. Oh, that's a sweet message from Kosovo. Jazakallah khair, Damir Kilmandi. Maybe see you very, very soon, inshallah. Ta'ala. Okay, people, are you all ready for a, a, a burst of the Rood Sharif for one minute or two minutes? Are you all ready, guys? Give me a thumbs up. Let's see how many thumbs up we got, inshallah. Abijani kitlu shok chala kovar. Anybody, inshallah. Do you, you got your shows on radio, though, haven't you? Monday iftar time. Mon- only Monday? Only Monday iftar time. Why, why so less this year? Too busy. <laughs> I Monday. got three shows in Batley on Saturday, by the way. Three, okay. So, all right. You got, we got the thumbs up coming up now. Okay, people, are you ready then? Monday iftar time, Khalid Bay's FCPM show. Okay, guys? Make sure you listen to it and you'll benefit greatly, inshallah, bi-ithnillah. All right, people. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Um, regarding the giveaways, what you need to do, don't forget, you need to uh, you need to follow me. You need to follow Rahman Mercy. You need to follow SNS Gym. You need to follow CMOS. And inshallah, tomorrow night, we're going to re- dis- um, do the spin the wheel, inshallah. And we're going to do the FIFA draw. And then we'll let you know who the winners are. You need are. to follow FCPM also. Oh, yeah. Media. Since we're here, you need to follow FCPM. Then I'll announce it tomorrow. Don't follow FCPM. Yeah, no, no, you have you have to follow FCPM as well, inshallah. Right, we're gonna extend another minute, inshallah. So, are you guys? Are you already? Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Khalibai, you're the dawn of this, so you can join in any time you want, inshallah. Bismillah ar-Rahim. Sallallahu ala Muhammad. Sallallahu alaihi wasallam. 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 All of you at home, inshallah, join in. صلى الله على محمد صلى الله عليه وسلم 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 من يسير النبي محمد really go for it folks really go for it إن شاء الله صلى الله على محمد صلى الله عليه وسلم صلى الله على محمد صلى الله عليه وسلم just one more minute guys inshallah read lots of love and muhabbat it's friday night think about rasulullah صلى الله عليه وسلم inshallah قريبا صلى الله على محمد صلى الله عليه وسلم صلى الله على محمد صلى الله عليه وسلم صلى الله على محمد صلى الله عليه وسلم صلى الله على محمد Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. One thing I would say here, by the way, mm-hmm. when we're reciting, it is presented to Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. It has been conveyed to him. And you should think yourself, subhanallah, that the spray of rahmat is hitting us when salawat is being recited. Super. Sallallahu ala Muhammad. Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. صلى الله على محمد صلى الله عليه وسلم last five times folks with lots of muhabbat inshallah صلى الله على محمد صلى الله عليه وسلم 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 
Mashallah tabarak al khali bay jazak Allah khair you know we had some lovely nasheeds ready you know that can we play that mahir zain one ya rahmatan lil alamin that's a really nice one guys are you ready for it folks i think it's it's rahmatan lil alamin by mahir zain and i had it ready yeah, like completely salla- forgot we were mashallah so busy with khalid bay that we completed uh, his barakat mashallah yeah. Guys, enjoy inshallah. We're here for a few more minutes. فديتك سيدي صلاة وسلام عليك يا نبي حبيبي يا محمد joining guys at home this is one of the best that she's this time about Nabi Sassan is beautiful حبيبي يا hope you can hear it folks يا محمد يا رحمة للعالمين يا محمد من حليت حياتنا للإيمان يا من بجنالك علمت الإحسان يا من نورت قلوبنا بالقرآن يا حبيبي يا شافعي يا رسول الله بأمي وأبي فديتك سيدي صلاة وسلام عليك يا نبي حبيبي يا محمد so beautiful it's lovely man soothing حبيبي يا محمد يا رحمة للعالمين يا محمد Khalid Bey, it's been a pleasure having you here. Jazakallah khair for I'm sure you this opportunity. You know, uh, it's been lovely. And uh, the great thing is we travel to Albania together, which we never got a chance oh, to um, talk about. Oh, that's a different story altogether. But we'll, uh, we'll, maybe we'll have another get-together, yeah. inshallah, before Ramzan ends, inshallah, tabarak wa ta'ala. And salam to the family from, uh, from us as well. And lovely to come in. And I'm glad you found your parking. People, um, can you share one of your funny stories? That's one for another day, inshallah. You can't give everything away at, at one time. Dream and do us, but one ill come, ill come, guys. I hope you had a wonderful, beautiful evening. And Khadija, yes, you, I believe you send your sons going Umrah this weekend. May Allah make his suffer easy for him, and make this Umrah be makbul. Inshallah, tabarak wa taala. Keep making your du'as tonight, guys. It's Jumma night. Make one de- request. The Hajjul is a must, must, a super sajda before Allah subhanahu wa taala, a super, super sajda before Allah subhanahu wa taala. Cry buckets. Talk to him, ask him, wherever you need, wherever your dunya and akhirah, ask Allah's there, Allah's waiting for us. And he's, when we ask, Allah gets extremely, extremely happy. So don't waste tonight. Go to bed now, wake up at three o'clock, have your suhoor, pray your tahajjud, and go into sajda, and then just talk to Allah. I'm telling you folks, you will be the happiest person after you talk to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Allah ta'ala give me and you the tawfiq. Wa akhiru da'wana lillahi rabbina from myself and Khalif Harba, a few last few words. Let's keep on reciting the rood inshallah. Make niyat of reciting every day, not just now. Every day, 1,000 the rood inshallah. And follow us on FCPM. Download the app. And mashallah, host the FCPM Durud Madlis at your house. Inshallah, let us know. Jazakallah khair. Allah ta'ala accept us all. I mean, a big jazakallah too, but two Muhammad's, you know, behind the scene, uh, Muhammad uh, D. Pakistan, Muhammad D. Thanbi Lodge, 
Um, the big, the big jazakallah khair to them. This show wouldn't be possible without that, without these two beautiful Muhammads, mashallah. Allah bless them. And it's been a really pleasant evening. The fact that Yas is not here today, it makes the evening even even better, right? Alhamdulillah. So guys, enjoy. Tomorrow night is going to be a super duper evening, inshallah. We've got a wicked topic coming up. I've not thought of it yet, but it'll come up by tomorrow, inshallah. Keep in your duas, inshallah, and speak to all of you tomorrow, bi'ithnillah. From me, Mawlana Khalid, and Khalid by inshallah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.